doesn't look good. The forecast said the cyclone would stay out at sea. And now it's changing direction. Hey, it's not all bad. At least we're getting out of the mass exam. <laughs> oh, man, I don't like the look of that. I'll catch you guys later. Going home to hide. It'll yeah, find you. Wherever you are. That's funny, coming from you. The teachers say the storm's coming on shore. Is that right? Let's soon find out. Of course it's coming on shore. It's coming straight for us. How do you know? Hang out with Sam long enough, you begin to see a pattern. Good times, eh, Ricky? <laughs> Memories. But I can't be blamed for a bit of bad weather. This is a serious bit of bad weather, Sam. The serious thing is I'm staying at your house tonight. Let's get the kites out. All the wind surfers? 10 four. How fast would they go? Push! <laughs> Come on, let's go home. Come on, Sam, we have to make the house safe. It's just an coming through. An AG day. Why am I the only one worried about a storm? You start, grab some torches. Oh, come on, Nathan, pick up. Where are you? Hi, you've reached Nathan from Fox Adventure Tours. I'm obviously up. Isn't he still on the dive boat? Hopefully not anymore. In a weather update, the Bureau advises that the intense low pressure system... Coming closer. I knew you were the target, Sam. Oh, these batteries aren't working. You OK, April? Of course I am. Why wouldn't I be? My drone business. Someone's grumpy. Nathan, hey, where are you? You OK? Yeah, I'm OK. I'm just uh, still up the coast. How is it up there? Yeah, it's fine. You're going to get the worst of the storm. I uh, still have to head into the estuary and shelter there, wait it out. Yeah, good plan. I guess that kind of rules out diving this afternoon, huh? Yes, it does. Now, Sam, with Mum and Dad away at the conference. You're it, OK? You know how people get during storms. You're in charge. We'll be fine. Yeah, this is a big one. All right, you hear me? Just keep everyone calm and safe. OK. Calm. We're doomed. Oh! And safe. Uh oh. -uh. Windows. Tape. Now. What a night to be staying over. It does indeed, Maxine. The folks down here say this is a storm to be taken seriously. Torch. What do you think I've been doing for the last... They're all flat. Maybe candles then? Well, they predict that will probably be within the hour if it remains on its present course. Over to you, Maxine. Gerald Smith at the Bureau... Storm's hitting the town pretty hard. As you just heard, this storm system is expected to bring torrential rain and local flood, so emergency... Ricky, turn that off! They are asking... That's the storm was outside. Seriously, April, you okay? Yeah, totally. Why wouldn't I be? I don't know, you've just got this storm thing. Storm thing? I don't know a storm thing. Agent P! So, Sam, uh, what can I do? <sighs> Go on the roof, make sure everything's secure. <laughs> I'm kidding. Look, get a couple of buckets of water just in case the water supply gets cut off. Onto it. Uh, buckets? Laundry? Where's Jordan? Harry? Good job on the windows. Where's Jordan? Checking for Fox Control. The shed? That's the worst place you could be during a cyclone. Quick. 
Alright, I've got the lid. Let's go. Mission complete! What's that doing in here? It's dangerous out there! Congratulations, now it's dangerous in here too. Dark! Told you, Sam's the bullseye. Oh, watch out, there's glass everywhere. Ricky, grab a broom from the hall cupboard. Right, hall cupboard. Cupboard in the hall? Got it. Just a few more screws and we're good with this one. Does this fit in the window, Sam? You dismantled your wardrobe? How did you... Never mind. Thanks, guys, but I think we got it sorted. OK, I'm going to the bathroom. Too much information. Very funny, Ricky. I'm going to the bathroom because it's the safest place in a house during a storm. Don't worry, April. Ages, J and H will look after you. Copy that. Thanks, guys, but I think this will be too big, even for you two. Wait a minute. I thought you foxes were completely fearless. But you're afraid of storms, aren't you, April? That makes you just like me. Ah! Give it away! Give it away! <laughs> Give it away! Gosh, I don't quite know how to take that, Ricky. Snake! What's your location, HMP? No, no, stop. I don't think the snake I saw was a python. Of course not. It was a carpet python. No, it, it was brown coloured. It had a black head. Oh, no. I think it's a taipan. A taipan? Is that bad? Was that a coastal taipan? I'm pretty sure. Is that good? That's deadly. Right, so two snakes on the loose, one of which can kill us. But yeah, that pretty much sums it up. <sighs> What is it, snake? No, bird. I'm going to the bathroom. Which way did the snake go again? Well, there, but I mean, it could be anywhere by now. Are you going to catch the taipan? Well, yeah, but if it gets in the walls or the roof cavity, nowhere in the house is safe. And I'm in charge, like Nathan said. Well, Agent J, I think Agent S needs some backup on this mission. Roger that. Agent S, we're here to help. I'm afraid you'd say that. April, let me in. What? Let me in. Why? Lots of reasons. Snakes, birds. Get your own panic room. Hey! Thanks, you won't regret this. I already do. Where are you sitting? The bath. Mind if I take the toilet? To sit on. Okay, listen up. Here's the plan of the house. I'm gonna go around. Where are coordinates? What? Oh, um, we're here. I'm gonna go around the house. If I see a snake, I'll call out and I want you to put a mark on the map. All right, now, whatever you do, don't move off that table, you understand? Wait, let's use these. Great. Um, the yellow snake can be for Agent P, the red one for the type N. Remember, don't move off this table. But how does all this help you catch the snakes? It helps me keep you on that table. Now. Mm -hmm. 
Where are the jelly snakes? No, I got a better idea. Come on. So, April, why are you afraid of storms? Well, Doctor, it all started when I was a child. Seriously? No, I don't know. Why are you afraid of birds? Interesting story, actually. That did start when I was a child. Look, we're all scared of something. Except Sam. Uh, now, you see, Sam overcomes his fears. He says he just thinks of something worse, and then the thing he's actually scared of doesn't seem so bad. Have you ever tried that? No, but... Okay, what's worse for you than thunder and lightning? Well, maybe if it was like... Indigo. I want all you guys to stay in the same place while I remove the taipan, okay? Wait, what taipan? Keep up, April! <laughs> Great. April, did you find those candles? Oops, sorry, forgot about that. Right, well, there's a snake on the loose and I'm gonna find it. Somehow in the dark. Um, make that two snakes on the loose and one bird. Be careful, Sam. Snakes can sense your body heat. Yeah, infrared vision. Wait, you mean snakes can see in the dark? How is that fair? Body heat. Thanks, Jordan. What did you do? Say something really clever. Like what? Dunno. So, I think you can sense my body heat, do you? <laughs> think again. Sam, you can do this. You're only catching a snake after all. I really hope this works. Ricky, the switchboard! The what? Check the switchboard. Maybe we can turn the power back on. Where's that? I don't know. Outside somewhere. Outside? I can't go out there. There might be more birds. But we have to help Sam. I'll go. No, you're too young. I'll go then. Jordan, I'm not likely to fall for that. I'll have to go myself. Wait, what about the taipan? Here, yeah, snakey snake. Nice taipan. Hey, let's be friends. I only want to help. Remember, his first bite, second, okay? Ha! <sighs> I knew you couldn't resist my charm. Don't worry, April. You have more chance of being eaten by a shark than being struck by lightning. Gee, thanks, Ricky. That's so reassuring. It's the other way round. No, I've read it somewhere. Jordan's right. You have a much bigger chance of getting struck by lightning than being eaten no, by a shark. No, I'm positive. Guys, that... this conversation is not making me feel any better. In Western Australia, there were six shark attacks. Ricky! Right. No. You've got to. Guys, can you please stop acting like two-year-olds? I need to go to the toilet. Oh, right. I 
Okay, guys, it's been great, but I think I'm going to take my chances outside. I can't hang on much longer. See me. Right? No, 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 no. Oh, come on, Taipan. I'm doing this for the both of us. Be brave, April. Be brave. Come on, April. Helping. Now, which one of you switches is supposed to go where? Hello, little type in. Come here. Come on. Oh, no, you don't. Come on. Come on. Agent P? Well then where's the Taipan? What are you building in there, Harry? Someone was expecting a lot more rain. <laughs> one snake down, one to go. You've been outside? Yep, piece of cake. Thanks. So, which snake did you catch? Oh, the Taipan, it's in here! <laughs> Go, go, go! It just jumped out of that! The Taipan was in there? I was just in there. See, you should be happy I made you move. We'll have to catch it. It could go anywhere. Way ahead of you, Jordan. What a night to be staying over. I knew something would happen. You're the Fox family danger magnets. All right, we need to call it. Oh, sorry. No, we need to call it down. Call what down? It's the Taipan. Snakes go to sleep if they're cold. Reality check, it's over 25 degrees in there. Why can't we just leave it? Shut the door and we're safe out here. We're not safe. It found its way in. It can find its way out again. Then we wouldn't know where it was until we stepped on it. Right, Agent S? Why don't we just get it a nice drink? Icy cold. Grab everything from the freezer. What? I, the ice, everything. Go! Cal, if you're not fit, it'll still be cold. Go, go, go! Oh, I've got a job for you, Ricky. I was afraid you'd say that. by the Taipan. Sam did say anything frozen. As soon as we go in, grab the towels. You ready? No. Go. Give him the Ricky. Ricky, put them on the towels. 
even the ice cream? I bet it doesn't even like chocolate. Hand him over, kiddo. Oh, yeah, don't need it all at once. Hello, I've just been extremely brave just now. It's working. That's it? No, you're amazing, Ricky. Thank you for risking your life. All I got was it's working. I mean, the snake's getting sleepy. Yeah, because I put cold stuff on it. So we can eat the ice cream now? It's done its job, Sam. It will be wrong to waste it. Very wrong. And wasteful. OK, OK. Just let me get sleepy head into a backpack and it's all yours. Check it out. The storm's over. <laughs> Someone's chirpy. Wasn't even that scary. Oh. Nathan! Nathan! Wow, it must have been quite a storm. A tree smashed the window. The power went out. April got it back on. And best of all... Coming through. <laughs> you were really keen to go diving. Can you help me with this type in? Yeah. Wait, did, 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 you, did you say type, type in? Yeah, it's just having a sleep. <laughs> it's sleeping because... Oh, close encounter with some frozen peas and ice cream. Hey, hey, and then the, the, the wetsuit is be oh, because... Mm, black air conditions, yeah. I created a thermal barrier so I couldn't see me in the dark. <laughs> right, nice move. No, not that I'm encouraging you to pick up deadly snakes. Best to leave that to the authorities. Hey, agreed. I've called them. They're on their way. Cool. Well, let's just keep it cool and calm until they get here. I'd stay away from Sam, Nathan. Or the Taipan will go straight for you. <laughs> How do you figure that? It's Sam. Don't say I didn't warn you. Ah. Ah. <laughs> See? How much more proof do you need? <laughs> 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 <laughs>